Hi, this message is going to be for Gemini. I'm Sam. This is Tarot Therapy. Just want to thank again everybody for liking and commenting on the comments below. If there's a way that you have any questions or if you want to reach me, um, all the information should be in the description box below. Okay. I don't know if it's in the comment box or description box. I'd have to double check that. But it's there. <laughs> It'll tell you how to contact me. If you're one of my clients or friends or family members, you already have my phone number. You can reach me there. Um, anyone else, if you just have questions or whatnot, um, you feel free to send me an email. Um, I don't mind responding um, to people who may want to do one question. Um, as far as the fee goes, I don't really know yet. So right now I'm open to it. Um, you can ask me a few questions and, you know, I'll respond, see what we can find. All right. And if you want to do a deeper reading, once um, you you get that one question answered, you can go ahead and um, request an appointment. Okay. I do phone readings. Um, if you're in Chicago, I do face-to-face -face readings and um, also can do email readings or Skype, video chat, um, whatever. Okay. Now, let's get into, did I say Gemini's? Yep, Gemini's. We did Libra, now we're on Gemini. Gemini, August 2018, this is your love scope. It could also be finances, work, or something around you at home or family. So, um, please don't be surprised if other things come out. It's all relevant, all right? So, let's see what's going on with our Gemini. Hi, Gemini. Oh, I see a, someone walked out of your life. Someone, this is going to be more like just one energy here, okay? Someone walked out of your life. Somebody decided to walk away. So if you're male, female, vice versa, and you're cross-watching cross for Gemini, um, here we go. Someone quickly is walking out of your home, out of your life. They're just like running away. And you're like, what did I do? Like, how to get this get so bad? Why am I heartbroken and crying? I don't understand it. So, I'm seeing this person. He's uh, He or she's ghosting. If you guys don't know what the word ghosting means, they're just disappearing on you. Like, they're in your life one second and they're out of it the next. So, it's not you, it's them. I'm seeing this person has some type of issues. They don't know how to get attached to somebody. Okay? They don't know how to um, love and care about somebody and then miss them and then they get scared because then they're hurt and they'd rather just run and leave than deal with their emotions. Okay? So I can't even see a sign here, but maybe it's more like right now a Capricorn or um, a Taurus or a Virgo. So I'm seeing more like an Earth sign. Okay? Um, but if it's not, you know, crosswatch, it could be any other sign as well. Um, but right now, since this is for Gemini, um, we are dealing here with um, an earth sign or somebody that maybe takes on the personality of the earth signs and I'm seeing here like they're being super stubborn and they're afraid of the commitment and they want to run away I do see them returning okay but they may return and act like oh what happened why what's going on like why are you mad at me like what did I do so you're gonna have to be like no you just can't keep ghosting on me like that you can't just run off whenever you feel like it whenever you feel like there's problems and there's maybe people judging us and gossip going on okay because this is the card about gossip and judgment people may be talking bad about other people and i'm just seeing here like okay this is not what i signed up for okay i did not sign up for this yes i want it to work on something with you but you can't just ghost you can't just take off and leave like you either stay or you go, but if you go, you better not come back. Because the next time you try to come back, look, you're going to be like, no, I'm done. You got no's. Like, I'm not going to come back to you. You waited too long. Gemini, you know, this is your, your feelings. You waited too long. You know, you kept me out in the cold. I've been by myself. You know, like, you just walked away when you felt like it, you know. Yeah, I know you're dealing with your feelings too. So you're saying, Gemini, I understand because you're very understanding, okay? And you're very patient too. So I'm just seeing here, like, you're very understanding with this person. You're like, you know what? I already know. I I've been there. I've been scared. I'm scared of love. But something's going on here where you're like, at some point, we got to grow up, okay? At some point, we got to be men. We got to be women. We got to be human beings, okay? And I'm seeing that you're going to be like, we can't keep playing with this love relationship. Either you come with me or you don't, or you stay with me or you don't. But none of this trying to put up balls and being stubborn about it. Like, 
this he needs to drop that act okay so this card is saying drop the act and gemini if this is not really like the person in your life that's acting this way maybe you're behaving this way towards somebody else okay or maybe you're being this way towards someone in your life maybe your mem family member maybe your mom or your dad if you live at home or if you have you know if you're living with your your husband or wife they might be like hey you can't just you know freeze up on me and like walk out of my walk out of um, a conversation an argument and just disappear and go for a ride no you gotta say you know what i need time to think i gotta cool off i'm gonna move on <laughs> i'm gonna move on right now you know i'm just gonna go and do my thing and you know go to you know hit up a friend or something go to a bar and chill and i'll call you tomorrow that's it just walk away and if it's not you, Gemini, then the person you're dealing with is definitely acting like this. Okay. So if they start sh being shady with you and start, you know, putting their walls up, Gemini, it's saying you got to let them know, hey, this is not how I communicate. It's not how I play things. It's not how I do this. It's not how I work. Okay. This is how I work. I communicate and I tell you, this is what I'm feeling. If you don't like it, well, then, okay, we'll talk about it. We'll try to fix it. We'll try to come to some agreement. But. If you do like it, then expect the same back from me because I'm going to only give you what you give me. So in this card is saying you are valuing yourself. You are standing up for yourself. But just make sure that if it happens again, if they start ghosting on you again, that you just make it final because you don't need anybody in your life that's going to, you know, put baby in a corner. <laughs> As Patrick Swayze would say, nobody puts baby in a corner and you cannot let this person do that to you. Okay. It's just been, it's time already. It's time for you to just be like, look, I'm done. I got to move on or we got to fix this and do something about it. Work on our friendship, work on our relationship, work on our marriage, work. You it could be a coworker. You know what? I work, work on our relationship at work. It could be a work wife, work husband. People have that nowadays. So I am seeing here like you're going to have a lot of um, mixed emotions about this situation. Okay. Yeah. Again, another situation. But here, I've been told that I'm not showing my decks. So here we go. Or my spreads. They're not like your common spreads. This is a hot mess spread. That's what I call it. The hot mess spread. Because there's so much, so much crap coming out here. So, all right, let me put this back. All right. If you saw me, hi. Um, if you didn't, um, there's a picture of me somewhere floating around the internet. I'm sure you'll find it. Um, okay, so let's get back to the reading. Like, So if this person um, decides to ghost on you, then you know what? You got to put up that wall. And if you decide to come, if they decide to come back, then you decide to take them back, but you take them back with the stipulations, okay? With one condition. And that condition is this, that you communicate anytime you feel like bailing because you can't just bail and then expect me to be okay with it. So I'm definitely seeing that type of feeling or energy here. Um, yeah, and then the thing is, I'm going to tell you right now, this person may just be like, you know what, screw you. I'm not going to deal with this. This is not what I want to do. I'm going to bail. And then there's a big old fight. And then here comes your battles. Okay, here comes your big battle. It could be your final battle. It's not even a battle. This is like the war. Because you lost so many battles with that relationship. So now you're going to end the war. And you're going to win this war because I'm seeing you here breaking free of any ties from this person um, after some... It's going to be like a good six months of healing. It's going to take you quite some time to heal, to move on from the situation if you decide to let it go. And this is for any male or female that is maybe um, dealing with someone that's making them feel like this, or maybe they're making someone else feel like this. This is for Gemini, August 2018, for love, okay? So be strong and just keep your foot down, you know? Like, just keep putting your foot down, keep it down. Don't move, don't get up, nothing. You gotta be still. Because if you do that, then they're going to think, oh, I can get away with this. I can do this. And no, you got to nip that behavior in the bud. And if it's gone on for too long, then you need to start retraining. Okay. Sometimes we got to retrain the people around us. You know, we need to tell them how we expect them to treat us. You know, the way I treat you is how I expect you to treat me. With respect, with kindness, you know, with gratitude, with friendship. And if that's not how you can talk to me or come at me, then... Bye. You need to go. All right. So I do see a, maybe a fight after this whole situation. Because I'm really seeing that the guy is just going to be like, you know what? If it's a girl or a guy, like, I don't care. Like, I'm going to go. I ain't going to deal with all that. All right. Well, then you keep, you know, playing with yourself in the corner. And you keep dealing with your own feelings. Okay? 
and I'm gonna just be straight out this is more for maybe a female and it's gonna be about a male he's gonna be a little bit older than you or he's gonna act like he's grown or has more maturity than you do but we all know that's not true because women are way more mature than men so I just see here that you're gonna make a decision and whatever it is I hope that it makes you happy and that if you resonate with this read you leave me a like and a comment you subscribe and if you want a personal reading all my information is in the big box we do the video thanks